good. Superb Al Sunday. Any given Sunday. We're watching it. Let's do this. Let's look at this. Cameron Diaz pulls the fucking Donald Trump beauty pageant dressing room trick. Just walks right on in while everyone's fucking naked. Look at this shit. She comes up and shakes this dude's hand while his big black uncircumcised dick is out. It is out, my dudes. Just hang in there. Fucking thing is like the size of my forearm, dude. What the fuck? Which, which is no big deal, because, you know, everyone everyone's looks like that. Uh, it's, it's about average. What's up, dudes? Something to uh, catch your attention? This film came out in 1999. I was nine years old. Sports was my life. So naturally, I wanted to go see this in the movie theater. Oliver Stone, Jamie Foxx, LL Cool J, biggest sports film of the year. And what do I get greeted by on the giant fucking movie screen? This guy's big black cock. Hadn't even seen my first cha-cha yet, but nine years old. Big black cock in the movie screen. Two years later, one of my buddies says, hey, y'all need to come over after school. I got this pornographic video, bruh. So I say, okay, sure, why not? Get to see some lady parts. I'm sitting in the living room full of fucking dudes, right? We think, okay, the girl's coming out. Gonna get a good shot at it, right? What do you think she's got between her legs? A big, black, uncircumcised cock. Fuck that guy, and fuck this movie. See, this is where I gotta be nitpicky. Oliver Stone actually does a decent job capturing the intensity of the game with some of these shots he has. Some of them are actually pretty impressive. But, my dude, he fucking completely missed the mark on this. This guy's wearing a full-on face mask and he loses an eye. Not like he gets poked in the eye. His fucking eye is on the turf. You see that shit? It's just popped out, hanging on the turf. Completely detached. And these trainers are casual about it. Look at it. They just like pick it up in a sandwich bag and pop it into a fucking lunch mate. And now they're just casually walking him off the field. Oh no, it's all good. He's just got a fucking missing eye. Bro, it's a fucking eye. You can't soak that shit in milk and just reattach it later. You need to take him to the ICU. Yeah, I'm not proud of that one. <laughs> Yo, Oliver Stone actually nailed this. It seemed like at one point, in like the late 90s and early 2000s, like every other sports star had a fucking rap album. You know what I mean? Like cheesy ass music video to go with it. It's so cheesy, but the context is perfect. Except for that, what the fuck, bro? No one wants to peep your cheeks. What the fuck is this, the room? All right, enough of that. Next scene. This is actually the best scene in the movie right here. But Chino kills it with the delivery on the speech. Three minutes to the biggest battle of our professional lives. All comes down to today. And you get the point. Be sure to tune in next time where we watch the Mighty Ducks backwards and decrypt all of its satanic messages. Until then, peace, love, respect, lates.